My name is Marlon Sawyer, and today I'll be showing you my social media campaign pitch for the public's own Greenwise Markets. Now, as we now all know, Publix's color is green, so is Greenwise. But what is the need to go green? So first off, this is our trending hashtag to generate the most interest um, with the, the new launch of the Greenwise Markets. Uh, implementing the social media campaign will benefit Greenwise Markets by increasing the total sales by at least 10% compared to last year's summer season, improving the brand awareness to reach more of that young adult customer base and also converting 1,000 new, um, new customers per week, developing brand loyalty with the current customer base to increase customer retention to at least 95%. And lastly, decreasing customer, the current customer turnover by at least 10% during the summer season that the social media campaign is running. So what's the strategy behind the social media campaign? So the structure of the social media campaign is built upon an editorial calendar. And within this is gonna contain everything uh, from the times and dates that certain content is gonna be released um, as to you know, what, what is going to be released um, for whatever the month, you know, whatever the month is. Um, the, from there, the target audience will show interest and engagement with the content. So we're always trying to you know, find so, sort of like the fresh new ideas to keep the young adults interested in what we have to offer. It's all about you know, fitting in and having that, that new appeal. Um, lastly, tracking the various quantitative and qualitative measures will, will determine the success or failure of the campaign. So it's always good to understand like, you know, before you get to the point of no return, am I doing, you know, what's keeping this campaign on track or am I headed in the wrong direction? And that'll kind of keep us, you know, keep us grounded and let us know, you know, what's working, what's not, if anything needs to be changed. All right, so the KPIs, also known as key performance indicators that will determine success for the campaign. We have website traffic, which is pretty much what it sounds like, measure the total measure of the con consumer traffic to the social media accounts, company websites, et cetera. Um, we also have the growth. So growth is gonna be the uh, total amount of present website traffic um, minus the total amount of past website traffic, just so we can kind of track the difference and see you know, are we improving and growing our customer base or are we losing people and we need to go back to the drawing table and switch, switch our strategy. Uh, the lead conversions, um, this is also pretty important too. Um, it's a measure of the number of customers that acted on lead, um, ultimately resulting in a conversion to Greenwise Market. And lastly, the uh, conversion percentage. So this is a measure of the Effectiveness of the social media campaign and its ability to seal the deal with a potential customer. Ultimately, um, utilizing a social media campaign will ignite a spark in the young adult age group that we struggle to connect with currently. Currently, we only are fluctuating around 31% um, of our total shopping uh, body is the 18 to 24 year group. So I think you know this would definitely alleviate that, bring more of the younger shoppers to Publix, since that's kind of where they lack. Um, also, you know, by by doing so, by implementing the social media campaign and the strategy, uh, we can also adhere to the original mission of the company, which is to be the premier food retail retailer in the world, while still having a passionate focus on customer value. Thank you.